Hey guys, Steel Games here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to use two audio output devices at the same time in Windows using OBS Studio. The first thing you're going to need to do is head on over to obsproject.com and install the latest version of OBS. So I'll go ahead and click the installation for Windows, then click Keep, and you would go ahead and run that and walk through the installation. Uh, but I'm not going to do that because I already have OBS installed. But once you install OBS, then you're going to want to go ahead and open it up. Then head on into the settings menu and find the section on the left called audio. Now under the advanced tab, you're going to want to set your monitoring device to the device that you want to use as a secondary to your default device. So let's say I want to uh, listen to audio out of both my speakers and my headset at the same time. So I'll go ahead and set my monitoring device to my Logitech headset and then I will set desktop audio, which I'm going to make my primary device, to my Logitech speakers, because that's what I have set currently as my sound device in Windows. So you can see I have Logitech speakers selected in Windows. Then I'll go ahead and go back to OBS, click OK. And now what I need to do is go to the desktop audio section in OBS, go to uh, advanced audio properties, and then under desktop audio, you're gonna go ahead and select the monitoring section and set it to monitor and output, and then click close. And then you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and uh, restart OBS. So I'll exit out and then I'll be right back with you once my recording is restarted. All right, and once you've entered back into OBS after closing out, you should notice that you can hear your audio through both your speakers and your headphones in this example. Uh, this will work with any devices that you want to use as long as one of them is set as the primary device for Windows. So you can use any two devices at the same time as long as one of them is set in your Windows settings as the default device. I have one last thing I want to show you guys in this video and that's how to start OBS when Windows starts so that as soon as Windows is finished starting up uh, you'll hear audio out of both of your devices at the same time. So you need to find your shortcut to OBS Studio. Mine's right here on my desktop. Then I'm just going to click it. I'm going to press Control C to copy it. And then I'm going to press Windows key and R to bring up the, the run menu. And I'm going to type shell colon startup. And that's going to open up a folder called startup. And here I'll just press Control V to paste my OBS Studio shortcut. And then the app will automatically start with Windows. Hopefully this helps you guys out. Until next time, I'll be seeing you guys later. Deal Games, signing out.